greetings and salutations, my fine friend. You are new to the city, are you not? Ah, then come closer. Uh, there are things you must know. Yes, yes, Agrabah is very dangerous. You cannot trust people. They will rob you blind. You are fortunate that I happen to be passing by. What is your business in our fair city? Oh, you are here to see the King of Thieves. How convenient. I just so happen to be the Prince of Thieves. Um, excuse me, I've been out of circulation for a while and I know things have changed, but you really mean to tell me that you are royalty? <laughs> just, of course. I, I am no prince. <laughs> Someone already ran that scam. I mean, uh, the King of Thieves. Yes, this way, right down the alley. I told you I could do it. Finally trick someone into entering the alley. They fell for it. Quickly, jump them. Whoa, wait. Stop. We can't do this. It's all wrong. They look like good people. We can't attack good people. Really? So all that planning was for nothing? I guess... I guess you're right. But what are you going to do now? Befriend them? Perhaps I will. Traveler, I hope you will give me another chance. Meet me back out in the street and I will find a way to make it up to you. Apologize. I'm Swan, the leader of the Hoods. We just aren't very good at this robbery business. We're thieves, but not the bad kind. We used to work the bazaar. When a corrupt merchant swindled an innocent citizen, we'd pick his pocket and return the gold, keeping a small cut. But the King of Thieves shut us down, under pressure from the other gangs, of course. Now those gangs have the run of the entire... Not only that, but after letting the city go down the drain pipe, the King of Thieves just skipped town, abandoning Agrabah to gang control. I'm sorry, this must be disappointing to you. The King of Thieves is who you came to see, right? Well, perhaps I have another idea. The King of Thieves abandoned not only the city, but his beautiful wife as well, Sultana Sharzad. These days, she's the only hope this city has. You should speak to the Sultana. In fact, I'll go too. I've been meaning to talk to her. Her apartment is across the bazaar. Meet me there. I know, I know, it was wrong. I admit it. But that's why I called it off. And here I am, coming clean. You have to give me some credit for that. I do. You have a good heart, Swan. Just do me a favor and stop trying to pretend otherwise, all right? As you wish. I'm yours to command, Sultana. You don't have to worry. It'll never happen again, I promise. You must be the wizard Swan spoke of. I hope you'll forgive the rude welcome you received. I'm afraid that's the legacy of my husband's reign. Please, come in, though. If you had matters to discuss with the King of Thieves, you can discuss them with me. I'll do what I can. So the Drommel nomads in Caravan are seeking aid to fight against who? Overlord Xerxes? Hmm. I'm not familiar with this name. Wait! Xerxes is resurrected? Oh, phooey! Then Urkal is back, too! Master, I must warn you, they are dangerous. And not very pretty, either. Be that as it may, I'm afraid we have little to offer in the way of aid. As you can tell, my husband was gallant, charming, and open-minded. But he was a terrible king. He let the city's gangs have their way in everything. The gangs once kept to the districts, but the king gave them free reign across the city. Law-abiding citizens now fear to leave their homes. Oh, and he didn't stop there. Gave them the palace, too. Great guy, huh? It's horrid. Have you seen the bazaar? 
so dreadfully... All that said, we do have a plan for restoring order. Perhaps if you help us, wizard, then we can address the threat of this overlord. First thing I need is my husband's vizier, Fazal. His home is just across the bazaar. Convince him to come here, and we can discuss the plan. What is this all about? You were supposed to be watching the door. Me? I thought you were watching the door. I mean, you said, I got the door. That was when I was opening it, you nincompoop. Bah! It doesn't matter. Just get them. want me to watch it? No, oh, you fool! Just get out of here!
praise the sands. Thank goodness you surprised us, uh, those ruffians, and ran them off. They were trying to rob me. I'm so glad you came. Really, the Sultana wants to talk to me? I thought perhaps she'd left the city, but all right, I will come. I will meet you at her apartment. There you are. It sounds as if you arrived at the vizier's abode just in time. Now you see how bold these gangs have become. I'm glad you are all here. Istar and I have come up with a plan for restoring order to act. The plan is simple. We rob the robbers, steal back what was stolen. We raid each gang's coffers and blame the theft on a rival gang. When the gangs go to war, we step in and negotiate a truce, requiring all gangs to stay out of the bazaar. We restore order to the city center. Oh, please, this plan is preposterous. With all due respect, Sultana, it would be better to leave the city. This plan will never work. Humor me, Fazal. I believe it will. Istar will accompany the wizard. First, they will steal back the armband of Zamir from the Feral's gang. Don't worry, wizard. I'll show you the way. Your part is to get in and steal back the treasure. I'll make sure the Thuggies gang gets the blame. I guess if the genie's going along, I'd just be dead weight. Undead weight, I suppose. How about I just stay here with the Sultan? That would be all right, I suppose. Perhaps you can tell me more about this overlord Xerxes. Wizard, Istar, our hopes go with you. Good luck. Well, here we are, the River District. <laughs> I know, it's so dingy. So let's not dilly-dally, we do our work here and get back to my ma She's amazing, isn't she? The Sultana, the best master I've ever had. My last master was a military captain. Now, where were we? Oh, getting into the Feral's waterfront warehouse. We'll have to rough up the felons until one of them coughs up a key.
Mother told me to stay away from alley cats. I should have listened. All my potential wasted. You want the warehouse key? Fine. Take it. Intruders in the warehouse. We keep them away from the treasures at all cost. Ugh, more ferals to fight? Really? How boring. Oh, I have an idea. With just a little genie magic. And now we have... Hmm, that didn't help, did it? Phooey. They were supposed to be little bugs, not scarabs. I hate scarabs. Those clicky mandibles creep me out.
Now that we're done with those nasty scarabs, we can get what we came for. The armband of Zamir is probably in that chest. Perfect. Now, just a little more genie magic, and we leave evidence here that the Thuggy gang was behind this. Oh, goodness! I had no idea this would be so much fun! Let's get back to the apartment and tell my master the good news! That was fast. You recovered the armband of Zamir. Excellent. I'll see it returned. Yes, absolutely. Fun. And now it's Ali Baboon's turn. He and his thuggy goons had the nerve to steal the Mask of Ejmir from a drama. Go to the Gardens District, find their stash, and steal back the mask. Istar, this time plant evidence framing the Fangs gang for the theft. Of course, Master. Oh, you know what? I could also use genie magic to bring down a plague of snakes in the Gardens District. That is an interesting idea, Istar. But I think just planting evidence to implicate the fangs is enough. Let's stick to the plan. 